Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply. This video is to bring you a closer look at the Donjo number SB-3 in a 619 finish. This is a surface bolt. Uh, it's a modern style surface bolt and I have one removed uh, from the packaging. Modern style surface bolts, they all look like this. We just call them modern style. I think it's because the company who is most notable for this design called it a modern style bolt. Very petite, rectangular in shape for the most part. Uh, small will allow you to secure a door without having an oppressive amount of hardware on the door. Uh, a bolt like this, because it's small, can be used to secure smaller size doors. Um, you'll often see a bolt like this used in a residential application when you have a door going downstairs to, let's say, a basement. Um, and you don't want your toddler being able to pull that door open and then um, so they'll add the bolt uh, to the top of the door where it's practically impossible not com not completely but but all but impossible for for someone who's tiny to be able to reach that very typical that spring is going to keep it in the vertical position or however you are installing it which is back behind here this is a three inch size these have historically been available in multiple sizes, uh, even shorter than three inch, although that's hard to get a hold of nowadays by, uh, I think it's possibly available by just one uh, manufacturer I'm familiar with. Three inch, that's the length, the width, about nine sixteenths, the thickness, about five sixteenths. Attaching this is super easy. Pull that bolt to one side, you've got a screw hole, push that bolt to the other side and there's your other screw hole. It's going to include six fasteners, even though you really only need four. I'm not sure why they would give you uh, six um, when well, you do only need four. Two, obviously, for the body itself, flathead screws, and two for the strike. And it's going to come with both a mortise and a rim strike, which means you can install these on either a push side or a pull side. The mortise strike is this rectangular one, about an inch and a half by half inch. The rim strike, about three quarter. Overall, about an inch and a quarter. Let's switch to the screen view and take a look how you might apply each of those strikes. Uh, this is a uh, 619, which means satin nickel finish. And it also means, 619 means brass. Yeah, the only thing that's ferrous on here is the spring that's behind behind there but everything else is a brass based material 619 means made of brass with a satin nickel finish let's switch to the screen view and take a closer look at how we would apply those strikes and uh, supporting documentation this is the item that we are looking at here slide bolt for surface mounting solid brass dimensions are provided that indeed says two inch, but that will be corrected uh, by the time you're seeing this video. It's three inch long. Includes those screws. Not, again, not sure why you would need six. Uh, and the reason I say that is you can't... Um, you, you wouldn't install both strikes in a single installation unless, of course, you were doing some sort of unusual application where you were going to bolt the door and say zero degree and then 90 degree, I suppose. Anyway, moving on about that. There is a link to the template, which is here. Gives you the dimensional properties. Also talks about the different finishes that are he that is here. 605 for polished brass, 613 for satin, uh, pardon me, 613 for oil rub bronze, 609 for antique brass, 625 polished chrome, 626 satin chrome. There's also a link to the product catalog. And we can take our part number, SB-3, we can copy that and paste that into the document and we'll find all of the sizes. What's nice is the 2 inch is available from Donjo. I would have guessed they did not make the 2 inch. The 2 inch is nice because it's truly petite and could be um, a better option for those lighter door applications where you don't want much hardware at all. Um, you know, 4 inch is common, 6 inch was common, getting beyond that 12 inch a little less common, but nonetheless, they are um, available. So very nice, modern style bolt. This design has been manufactured for decades upon decades. 
Um, so neat. The rest of the catalog will allow you to look at other surface and slide bolts that are here. So I would encourage you to review that. Other accessory hardware is in here. So it's a nice catalog to look at the uh, accessory and related hardware from Don Joe. Okay. Now, we talked about where you would use those different strikes. Um, you know, let's just, let's just say that you're going to install it at the top of a door. Okay. And let's say that your door uh, swings in to the space. You're going to want your bolt to be over here, right? Well, you would take that rim strike and you would install it here so that your bolt can engage the rim strike. Now, let's say that you have the same door, but it swings out. Okay, well, you're going to want your bolt in here, right? And you're going to take, this is an awful drawing, but you're, <laughs> let's, let's get that a little bit better. You're going to have your bolt, and then you're going to take that mortise strike and mortise it here so your bolt can engage here. You wouldn't install the rim strike here. It would be impractical. The rim strike would hang out over in this area. So, you know, pull side mount, probably rim strike. Push side mount, uh, probably mortise strike. Uh, but, you know, no hard and fast rules, but that's generally where you are going to see that installed. Uh, link below this video to the manufacturer's page that will allow us to review not only all of the Don Joe products that we sell by means of that horizontal navigation, but also a link to the website, to their website, and a link to their most current product catalog, also broken up into several and many product catalog subsections. Okay, A template master index is here as well. Let's wrap up this video on camera. In conclusion, a nice quality little uh, item that you can use in a variety of applications. This client literally has purchased um, bifolding door locks along with these slide bolts. Um, I don't really see how they're using them on the same opening, even though uh, it's possible that they are. Um, You know, I've had people install bifolding doors where there was occupancy on both sides of the door. A bifolding door would be for a closet. You wouldn't, you couldn't stand in there, you know, if you wanted to, I suppose. But I've seen bifolding doors that separate two two bedrooms. Um, so perhaps there's a key on one side, you know, to keep someone out from going into your space. And then when you're in the space, you can throw the bolt on the inside. That I've seen. Um, these are likely different doors. Um, so anyway, uh, nice quality item. I wouldn't hesitate to use it. I wouldn't hesitate to use items from Don Joe. Uh, they are a uh, relatively, not relatively, they're a simple, straightforward, no-nonsense uh, sort of outfit that has uh, a rather petite yet comprehensive offering of trim and auxiliary material. Uh, and a trip through their catalog would uh, show you many items that you simply may not be familiar with. If you know the name Don Joe at all, you probably do because of their door reinforcing wraparound plates or their um, latch protectors. But you'll see there's another 10 catalog sections there of hinges and ladder poles and surface bolts and roller latches and extended lip strike plates as well. So don't hesitate to review their catalog. Any questions on the Don Joe SB-3 surface bolt and a satin nickel finish? or any other Donjo product, please feel free to reach out to us. And thank you.